your voice. Put your thoughts, ideas, and opinions out in the world, even if it scares the shit out of you. Whoa. Um, <laughs> rewrite. Exercise your fucking body. Move away from your desk. It's possible to take care of yourself and achieve your dreams, and you'll probably do better work if your brain is getting oxygen. It's so true. Y'all, for the last six months of 2013, I did not exercise. I completely fell off the wagon. I was drinking wine every night. I was like in another era. And this January, I got everybody Fitbits for Christmas at our company. And we have gotten competitive and we have joined gyms and we are exercising every day. And I'll tell you, even if I have to go back to the office after exercising at 11 o'clock at night or whatever time it is, Taking that break and going and moving my body and getting oxygen and getting a break and like pounding the stress out is so helpful. I had a client call me on the way to the gym about two weeks ago and I physically could not answer her question. She asked me for an idea for something and I said, you know what, I, I, I was basically just speechless. And I was pulling into the gym parking lot, I said, I'm gonna go in here, I'll call you back whenever I get out. And it was magic. I went into the gym, I didn't think about her issue at all while I was in there, I just went through my workout. And I came out and I called her when I got home, I was cooking dinner, and all of a sudden I just had this clarity and I had like five or six great ideas, none of which they actually used, but that's irrelevant. <laughs> they were really good ideas. Um, they were actually such big ideas that they didn't know how they would do them, and it was something that was happening the next day. But just spending that time moving and, and getting that stress out helped so much. <laughs>